this conference with something that I had when I came in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. I'm right. going to leave it yeah, yeah. right here. Yeah. This is my exodus yeah. Yeah. for this situation. Yeah. You know what the situation is. Yeah. But yeah. today is the day. This is the exodus. You're leaving that thing. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. No more free rides in yeah. this thing. Amen. With this situation. Amen. 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 God is good, and I tell you, God is faithful. Mm, He is faithful. Lord, we thank you today, Lord God. We thank you for having your way. And we thank you for expressing your love to each and every one of us, Lord God. Lord God, we we thank you for your word, for you are your word, and just expressing yourself to us, Lord God, of how important we are to you, Lord, that we are precious. We are so precious that you sent your son to die for us, Lord God. And we thank you, Lord God, better than silver or gold. In the name of Jesus, you are a great God. Lord, I will decrease, Lord, and Lord, I ask that you increase. Bless your people. Bless your people. In Jesus' name, Amen. 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 Dignity and strength. Mm-hmm. Hallelujah. It's time for you to recognize who you are. Amen. Amen. That is my title. Amen. It's time for you to recognize who you are. We begin to see things so much through the natural eye. Mm-hmm. Yes. We, we uh, compare ourselves with others by what we see in the mirror through our natural eye. Mm-hmm. But we are not a natural being. We are a spiritual being that's in a fleshly body. Amen. Amen. A physical body. But we are spirit. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. And we need to see ourselves as that. But it's time for us to recognize who we are. A lot of times we just don't know who we are. We get confused. Mm -hmm. Uh, The speakers have come forth and they said, you know, we can speak it. You know, and, and we got power, we got strength, mm-hmm. we, we we have the, the mind of Christ, mm-hmm. we got the power of Christ, yeah. but we just don't know who we are. Mm-hmm. And that's why it's good to attend conferences. Mm-hmm. That's why it's good to go to church on Sunday. Mm-hmm. That's why it's, it's good to be in the word of God. Mm-hmm. That's why it's good to come to praise and worship. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Because you begin to hear the testimonies, you yes. begin, mm-hmm. begin to hear the facts of who you are, Amen. of who yes. we are, yes. Amen. Glory. as an individual, yes. but also as a, 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 a in the body of Christ. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. That we are more than just what you see. Amen. You are more than just yes. that trouble yes. and that situation yes. that you're going You are so much more than that. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. I want us to turn to, I don't want that one yet. I'm going to get that one. I want us to go to uh, Exodus. Exodus chapter 4. Hallelujah. That's a note missing. Okay. Glory to your name. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Exodus chapter 4. Mm-hmm. We're going to look at Moses. A lot of times we don't know who we are. And when God sees us, uh-huh. he sees us with that perfect plan that he has. Mm-hmm. You have been specially selected uh-huh. Come on. to do the task that God has called you to do. Amen. Some, of the, some of us, that task might be just to be that godly wife. Amen. To be that, 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 that godly mother. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Some, yeah. Of, some of us are called to just that task. Amen. And they do it very, very well if they know who they are yeah. and what's in their hands at this time. Yeah. Yeah. As he tells Moses, use that that you have in your hand. Yeah. Yes. That staff that I've given you, uh-huh. you're going to be able to do exploits yeah. with that staff. Uh-huh. You're going to be able to do miracles, signs, and wonders uh-huh. with that staff. Yeah. When you lay that staff down, mm-hmm. it's going to do what it what you're telling it to do. Mm-hmm. Amen? Amen. And a lot of times we just we just don't know. Hallelujah. So we're looking at uh first we're going to go to Exodus 3, chapter 3, and we're going to go into 4. 
But Moses in this burning bush. Let's look at, uh, if I start at verse 11. Hallelujah. Amen. Now we're going to back that up. Go to 3.1. Now Moses was tending the flock of Jethro, his father-in-law, the priest of Midian. And he led the flock to the far side of the desert and came to Hor, the mountain of God. There the angel of the Lord appeared to him in flames of fire from within a bush. Now Moses saw that though the bush was on fire, it did not burn up. This is an interesting sight. Yeah. It's an interesting thing that is going on right now. And a lot of times there are situations and things going on in our life that begins to get our attention. Yeah. And, it, and it's like, okay, all right. And then you begin to find out that's God calling you. Yeah. That little thing would stir it up yeah. to get your attention. Yeah. Yeah. That little little thing, you know, uh, uh, God was calling you. Amen. He said, I, I, I want you. I desire you. And not only that, I have a plan for you. Yeah. And you never have to be afraid of the plan of God for your life. Amen. Because if God calls, God is going to provide. Yeah. God is going to make a way. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. Amen. Verse 3, so Moses thought, I'm going to go over and see this strange thing. Why the bush does not go up, uh, uh, burn up. Mm -hmm. When God called uh, us, uh, my husband and I, uh, into the kingdom, mm -hmm. uh, we were going through financial situations and, you know, and things of that nature. So when I went to a Bible study and began to find out that God has a plan even in that with your finances, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, you know, I never, it never came across my mm -hmm. mind that he is concerned about money mm -hmm. or anything like that. Mm -hmm. And so it's like, you know, let me get into this thing and see what he's talking about. Mm -hmm. And he got to talking about how your purse have holes in it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you know, you, you yeah. know, this is happening and taking yeah. your money and that's yeah. happening and taking yeah. your money yeah. because I'm trying to get your attention, uh -huh. but you're not recognizing it's yeah. me. Yeah. And I will show you the yeah. way yeah. to hold on to your money better than what you've been trying to do. Uh -huh. And so Moses saw that there's fire inside this bush, mm -hmm. but this bush isn't burning up. How mm -hmm. can this be when you're in a desert? Mm -hmm. It ain't like this bush got all these leaves and everything yeah. on it. and Amen. It's so so Boy, green, uh -huh. you know, and everything that it, it would slow down the burning mm -hmm. process. No, it's in the desert, desert. So I imagine this bush probably doesn't have anything on it. Mm -hmm. It's just a dried out, uh, tumbleweed looking mm -hmm. bush that's there and God used this weird thing as he uses a lot of us yeah. not with the top education yeah. not yeah. with this and that yeah. not with all the finances yeah. God used this tumbleweed yeah. like this yeah. and got a fire go in it yeah. and the fire is not going out yeah. Yeah. it had to be something supernatural going yeah. on that it got Moses attention yeah. I'm sure he saw fires and different things that happened uh, working in the desert but not this one it was something special about this bush as he went over to see what was going up and verse 4 says when the Lord saw that he had gone over to look God called to him from within the bush. And now his name is being called. Now you know this is a crazy situation. It's a burning bush, but it's calling out my name. Hallelujah. Is somebody playing with me? What, what was in that last drink I had? Oh my God. What, 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 what is going on? And the bush said, Moses. Moses. And Moses said, and now I'm talking to a bush. Oh, you know, there's a story with a man with a donkey talking. But now I'm talking back to a bush. Yeah. Hallelujah. And Moses said, here I am. And then the bush said, do not come any closer. <laughs> Take off your, your sandals. For the place where you are standing yeah. is holy ground. Yeah. And then he said, I am the God of your father. Yeah. The God of Abraham. Yeah. The God of Isaac. Yeah. And the God of Jacob. And at this, Moses began to hide his face. Yeah. <laughs> Hallelujah. Ooh. Moses is going through some changes. Yeah. Hallelujah. He's yeah. going through a, a process yeah. right now. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. He hid his face because he was afraid to look at God. Yeah. Now he recognizes. Uh, Didn't take him all day. Yeah. Hallelujah. That supernatural thing that's yeah. going on yeah. around me, that's going on in my life, I recognize it. Yeah. I recognize it because I am a man of God. Yeah. I can recognize it because I am a woman of God. Yeah. I can recognize that God is moving. Yeah. And God has called out my name. Hallelujah. So God has an 
assignment for yeah. this. Yeah. There's something that God wants yeah. us to do. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. The Lord yeah. said, mm -hmm. I have indeed seen the misery of my people well, in yes. Egypt. I have heard them crying out because of their mm -hmm. slave drivers. Mm -hmm. I am concerned about their suffering. Well, Don't ever think uh, that God is not concerned about you and your situation. Yeah. Hallelujah. We've been talking about a woman of noble character. Yeah. But if you happen to be in a situation where the man beats you, mm -hmm. where the man is hitting on you, yeah. whether the man is talking about you, I have seen your suffering. Yeah. And I am coming down. Come on. I am coming down. are oppressing him, them. Now, their cry has reached me. Mm -hmm. It's not like God didn't know. Amen. He knows about your yes. situation. Yes, he, he sees the tears. He knows yes. about the suffering that you're going through. Amen. But there, God is going to move yes. in that thing. Hallelujah. He's going to move in that situation. Lord, he will. Lord. It's like, God, I know you're here with me. Yeah. Hallelujah. Somebody said, when you anointed me, I smell God. Yeah. Hallelujah. When your things begin to change, yeah. you know that God is in the house. Yeah. God, you done stepped up in my house. Yeah. I'm beginning to see some changes. Yeah. I'm beginning to see a little tenderness. Yeah. It's not a little kind, God. But I see a little kindness coming in. Yeah. Hallelujah, Lord God. Oh. I even heard the man say that he loved me. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Lord God, hallelujah. Yeah. You told me, Father, just be patient, Lord uh -huh. God. Speak your word to the situation. Yeah. Speak your word to that man. Oh. And when the Lord tells you to be quiet, uh -huh. just be quiet. Yeah. Hold your peace. Yeah. Yeah. Keep your peace with you. Amen. Don't release it. Yeah. Hallelujah. Don't release your peace. Yeah. Hallelujah. By the words of your mouth. Hallelujah. Because our words as being women of God, yeah. if you're walking rightly in line yeah. with God, your words Word. are powerful. Yeah, that's right. You can't just release your peace in anything over anybody. That's right. Hallelujah. Absolutely. If they ain't right, take, take your peace back. back. Woo! Yeah. You trying to cover. Yeah. Ooh, yes, Lord. Ooh. Covering 
people that yeah. should not be covered. Yeah. Amen. Praying for people that God is saying, uh-uh, because I'm not going to hear you mm. in that situation. Yeah, I right. already have a plan of what I'm going to do. Yeah, amen. Yeah. Yeah. Glory. Yes, Lord. You think Ooh. the Israelites wasn't praying for Pharaoh? Uh, Lord, soften yeah. his heart so he'll let us go. <laughs> Lord, soften his heart yeah. so he'll let us go. And then God will go in, Moses will go in there and talk to Pharaoh. Pharaoh changed his mind as soon as he's out of the presence. Yeah, so right. will. Yeah, sure did. And God will say, you know what? Take the staff and tell him this. Mm -hmm. Take the staff mm -hmm. and tell him that. Hallelujah. Yes, right. Because he's not going to let you go uh -huh. until I move with a yeah. stiff hand. Yeah. yeah. Oh, God. Yeah. When I move with a stiff hand, then the change is going to yeah. come. Amen. Hallelujah. Yeah. Some of you are saving people mm. that are not to be saved at this time. Right. That's right. Oh, wow. mm -hmm. Watch it. That's right. Mm. Why are you so sick? Mm -hmm. Come on. Mm. That's right. Why are you so all tied up? Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Yes. I'm just saying, seek the Lord on that. Yes, Lord. Because you may be covering some people, mm -hmm. doing some things, and when you're praying for them, that, that God is like, I'm not moving in that. Yeah. But because of you, yeah. Yes. I'm gonna allow them to, you know, to go through or to be safe mm -hmm. or this or that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But then you picking up no, the weight. Wait. Yeah. yeah. Right. You picking it up on you. you. Yeah. 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 Because in other words, you're saying, well, Lord, I'm going to stand in the gap. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. The punishment that should be for them, mm -hmm. you can give it to me. Yeah. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. wow. I, I, I can carry some. Because mm -hmm. you want to stand in the gap. Yeah. He didn't say you got to stand in the gap yeah, for everybody. everybody. That's true. Yeah. That's right. Hallelujah. Wow. That's right. Check yourself. Amen. You think because some people left, or some people leave out of your life that there's Lord bring them back, bring them back, bring them back, and God might be saying, I did this. Yeah. I did this. I allowed this to happen. They need to move on out of your life. They need to move on and do what they need to do. Yes, absolutely. Come on. They can't stay there with you because they're not seeing with you. Amen. They're not walking with you. Come on. Not same spirit. Come on. Woo. Amen. Amen first lady. So we're just praying for stuff because it's, 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 it's the right thing to do. Now, when you get you you, you get you start getting mature in the Lord, you find out that mm -hmm. a lot of this stuff at a certain time, you begin to find out, okay, Lord. Mm -hmm. Okay. True. True. I, I, I see. Mm -hmm. I, I, you know, I leave that alone. Mm -hmm. you know, Absolutely. Your will be done. Yeah. Amen. That's it. Right there. Right. They don't will be done. Yeah. If they come back, they come back. If they don't, they don't. They come yeah. in my life, they come back. Okay. God, you will continue to guide me and lead me. Mm -hmm. yeah. But if this is the time that they are to be released, mm -hmm. let them move on. Yes. Yeah. Bless them. Let them move on. Yeah. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Glory to God. Oh, yeah. It is so. Sometimes we just don't know who we are. Amen. Yeah. Ooh, Lord. You think you still over here. Mm -hmm. And God done raised you up such a long yeah. time ago. Right. When you, you're over here, yeah. but you're still yeah. acting yeah. over yeah. here. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. right. See, the way uh, Tommy and Jocelyn act now, mm -hmm. when God raised them up and they, they uh, 25, uh -huh. yeah. Uh -huh. And still doing the stuff that and acting like they were over yeah, here. Yeah, something, something wrong, wrong with that picture. picture. Yeah, yeah, sure enough. Yes, Lord. Yeah. Because we grow in Christ. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Mm -hmm. yeah. Our God is a living yeah. God. Yes, yes. absolutely. Continue Ooh. to grow in Him. Mm -hmm. Continue to mature in Him. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. Bless your word, Lord. Thank, Thank you, Lord. Lord. Thank Lord Hallelujah. Mm. Yeah. But Moses, and this is going to 11, but Mo, uh, uh, 311, but Moses said to God, who am I that I should go to Pharaoh and bring the Israelites out of Egypt? Now, the problem I have with this, okay. a lot of people are more afraid of man mm -hmm. than they are of God. Come on. Mm -hmm. That's right. so true. Because if I, I, if I reverence God, he would have to explain all that. If I know that that is God that said that, uh -huh. he is uh, the creator, the yeah. all-powerful yeah. one, the almighty, his kingdom reigns. Yeah. If I know it was him, oh my ass 
tripping about going before another man. Right. Mm -hmm. Just because he got horses and people that run before him saying, Oh, behold the king, you know, I'll have the king. Right. Because <laughs> mm -mm. I know this is, he's God. Yes. So you can see Moses' uh, uh, reluctancy right there. Yeah. Right there. Even though now he knows he's talking to God, it shows you that it's not a strong relationship yeah. Amen. in God. Amen, that's mm -hmm. right. Mm -hmm. See, we can have all the head knowledge, mm -hmm. right. but heart. that heart, yes. that's that it's the heart, heart. Yep. Yep. Yes. because he know all of my Pharaoh. Yeah. Yeah. He, I was raised up in Pharaoh's house, and I, I know all of, I know what they do. I know how they can make you suffer and all that, but I know God is a, is a good God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Yes. Everybody wasn't, God is a good God, <laughs> which is true. Because everything he do is good. Yeah, Whether you in your suffering state right now, he's still good. Whatever you going through, it does not diminish anything about our God. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Right. Hallelujah. Yes, my Lord. Yeah. <laughs> Who am I that I should go to Pharaoh and breathe the Israelites out of Egypt? And God said, I will be with you. And this will be the sign to you that it is I who have sent you. Mm -hmm. And when you have brought the people out of Egypt, you will worship God on this mountain you're standing on right mm -hmm. now. But Moses said to God, look at this, suppose I go to the Israelites and say to them, the God of your fathers has sent me to you, and they ask me what is his name. Then what should I tell them? Mm -hmm. What if God sent you to your neighbor that you don't know, really know? Who am I supposed to say you are? Because really you don't want to go. Mm -hmm. You're looking for another excuse. Mm -hmm. The excuse. God will get tired of the excuse. Excuses. Excuses. Yeah. Because you know what? Being a perfect God, if he called you, mm -hmm. that was you the perfect one. one. Yes. Ah, glory. Yes. Hallelujah. If all his words are excellent yes. and yes. praiseworthy, yes. if he called you, yes. you're the perfect yes. one. Yes. Blessing designed for you. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord. For your obedience. Amen. Thank, Thank you, Lord. Amen. Amen. Yes. I mean, you're the perfect one. Yes. Thank you. Mm. And God, verse 14, God said to Moses, um, verse 13, Moses said to God, Suppose I go to the Israelites and say to them, The God of your fathers has sent me to you, and they ask me, What is his name? Then what should I tell them? All right, now, not, not dealing with Pharaoh. Now I got to right. go and deal with my own people. Right. You know. Then God said to Moses, "I am who I am. <laughs> this is what you are to say to the Israelites. Yes, I am has sent me to you. Yes. They have been in bondage mm. for over what 405 yes. years. Yes. And and at that time, they have gotten away." From the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Yeah. That's why he got to remind them. Mm -hmm. You've been in your situation so long. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you don't even seek me to move. Mm -hmm. wow. you, you, you know what? You, you, you know, uh, uh, look to me as the way Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob did. Mm -hmm. They knew who I, who mm -hmm. I was or yeah. who I am. Mm -hmm. You don't. Mm -hmm. So tell them, I am who I am has sent you. All right. Amen. You got to go talk to Linda Lark, the God of their fathers, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob. He lets you know it's the same. Same, same God mm -hmm. has sent me to you. This is my name forever. Mm -hmm. The name by which I am to be remembered from generation to generation. I am. I am. Go assemble the elders of Israel and say to them, The Lord, the God of your fathers, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, appeared to me and said, I have watched over you yeah. and have seen what has been done to you in Egypt. Yes, thank you, Lord. He sees you in the state that you're in. Oh, you're crying tears every night because of a broken heart or whatever the, the suffering is in your life. Mm -hmm. uh, he's seen it. He's with you. And I have promised to bring you up out of your misery in Egypt and to this, uh, these other lands. 
Verse 4, look at uh, chapter 4. Moses said, what if they do not believe me or listen to me and say the Lord did not appear to you? Huh? He coming up with the curse. Then the Lord okay. said to him, what is that in your, ha in your hand? A, a staff, he replied. And the Lord said, throw it on the ground. Moses threw it on the ground and it became a snake and he ran for it from it. And then the Lord said to him, reach out your hand and take it by the tail yeah. to let you know that you got the power. Amen. Because I am with you. Amen. Take that deadly thing mm -hmm. and, 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 and take it by the tail. Yeah. So the head can still move. The head, the yeah. snake can come whirl yeah. back around yeah. and bite you. But I want you to take it by the tail. Uh -huh. See, I got to build up some courage in you. Yeah. Yeah. I got to build up some strength in you. Yeah. Take it by the tail. Yeah. You're not going to do it the regular way. Right. Right. You know, right. when you cover the head or you mm -hmm. try to grab the mouth or something like that where the mouth would open up and bite you. Mm -hmm. take, so Moses reached out and took hold of the snake and it turned back into a staff in his hand. Then said the Lord, this is so that they may believe that the Lord, the God of their fathers, the God of Abraham, making it plain, the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob has appeared to you. Because you know the stories. Mm -hmm. They know the stories of the forefathers. But that happened during their time. Mm -hmm. It hasn't happened in my time. Now we want to go to Judges. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Another one with excuses. We're going to look at Gideon. Judges 4. And we know that with Gideon, it, it was a lot of problems and things going on. Hallelujah. Get, uh, Judges chapter 6, verse 1. And again, the Israelites did evil in the eyes of the Lord. Mm -hmm. And for seven years, the uh, he gave them into the hands of the Midianites because they were doing evil. They're not believing in him. Mm -hmm. They they didn't turn their back. And so when people turn their back on the Lord, now they're wondering why this is happening. Amen. Amen. Why things are happening in my life the way they are. Yes. Now, if things are happening and you're walking with the Lord, you can pretty much say that you might be under a test. Yeah, all right. You pass the test, the thing is over. Yep. Yes. <laughs> you know? But when you know you're not following God, mm -hmm. but I believe God. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you hear that? Yeah. I believe God. I believe God. And, and they cussing. Mm -hmm. They doing everything else, walking in lust, uh, mm -hmm. walking in, in uh, just debauchery. Mm -hmm. But the, I, I love the Lord. I know the Lord. I don't have to go to church. I don't have to do this. Mm -hmm. I don't do that. I'm a Christian. And now I, I would have to say, you know what? I would be very careful. Come on, come on. You're walking a thin line. Mm -hmm. Because once you you taste it and see that he is good, once you walk with the Lord, what's the turning back to what? Yeah. Nothing can compare to him. Amen. Nothing compares. Amen. Hallelujah. Because the verse two, because the power of, the, of Midian was so oppressive, the Israelites prepared shelters for themselves in mountains and cliffs and caves and strongholds. It wasn't looking under God's arm. Mm -hmm. It wasn't Psalms ninety one. Right. Right? Under the shelter? Uh uh. No, they, they were they made for themselves mm -hmm. shelters. Yeah. I'm gonna trust in this for one. I'm going to trust in this stock market. Uh -huh. Anything but God. Yeah. Anything but God. Yeah. I'm going to make me some quick money. Mm. <laughs> Come on now. Anything but oh God. God. They make shelters. Yeah. What are you building? Yeah. What are you putting? Okay. In, what, is, in what has become your shelter? Right. If it's not the Lord. Yeah. Hallelujah. Verse 3, whenever the Israelites uh, planted the crops, the Midianites, the Amalekites, they say the car broke down, the washing machine acted up, and the other eastern peoples in the, uh, invaded the country, and now I'm just, I'm just broke. The bank is in the negative. All this keep happening over and over and over and over and over and over. Yeah. 
Another year, over and over and over. Another year, over and over and over. Another year. Cycles. <laughs> the Midianites camped on the land. Some of you guys, you know what? That demon is camping. Come on. Right there. All your pocketbook. Every time it gets full, he thinks of a situation for it to get in. Come on. Yes, he does. He is camped there and he's running the crops. All the way to Gaza, did not spare a living thing for Israel, neither sheep nor cattle nor donkey. The enemy does not care. They camped up with their, they came up with their livestock and their tents like swarms of locusts. Mm. It was impossible to count the men and their camels. They invaded the land to ravage it. Mm. Midian was so impoverished, yeah. the Israel they so impoverished the Israelites that they cried out to the Lord for help. Hallelujah. And when the Israelites cried to the Lord because of Midian, mm -hmm. because of this hardship, yes. because of this money keeps fleeing, mm -hmm. because of the doctor's report that keeps coming, mm -hmm. he sent them a prophet. Yeah. God sent a word. Yeah. God yeah. sent a word who yes. said, this is what the Lord, the God of Israel said. And you know what? There was a time I brought you up out of Egypt, mm -hmm. out of the land of slavery. I snatched you from the power of Egypt, mm -hmm. uh, from the world, and from the hand of all your impressors. I got you out of this situation. Mm -hmm. I drove mm -hmm. them from before you mm -hmm. and gave you their land. Mm -hmm. I said, I am the God, your God. Do not worship the gods of the Amorites in whose land you are on now. Right. But you have not listened to me. All right. The angel of the Lord came and sat down under the oak at Ophrah mm -hmm. that belonged to Joash the uh, Bezerite, where his son Gideon was threshing wheat in a wine press to keep it from the Midianite. Mm -hmm. Now when the angel of the Lord appeared to Gideon, we saw how uh, Moses reacted. But when he appeared to Gideon, he said, the Lord is with you, mighty warrior. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm hiding. My people hiding. We doing things at certain times when the Midianites are not there. We're hiding in our own private shelters that we done built. And we're doing things so that the enemy will not see us. And nobody has came up with an idea. Nobody has said anything about making some sacrifices or, or anything like that. But Lord, you going to come and tell me that I am a mighty warrior. God's people don't know who they are. All right, come on. Lord, oh, there are mighty warriors in this room right now. Yeah, God. You don't know who you are because you're not using all that He has given you. Amen. Test it, try it. You know, before you buy a car, you test it. Yeah. Is it riding smooth? Is, is it doing this? How does it handle going around curves? And how does it handle it uh, uh, high speeds and things mm -hmm. like that? We'll test anything else, but no, nah, we ain't going to bother God. <laughs> you know, we're not going to try that. All right, to find man. out who you are. Amen. To allow God, if it doesn't go your way, mm -hmm. that you seek the Lord and allow him to speak to you. Amen. Thank you. He will speak to you. Yes. Yes. There's nothing nobody else has that you can't have mm -hmm. from the Lord. Amen. He will speak to you also. But Sarah, Gideon replied, if the Lord is with us, why is all this happening to us? Mm -hmm. Then we go back to verse 1. Again, the Israelites did evil mm -hmm. in the eyes of the Lord. Mm -hmm. Why is it all happening? Because it ain't about right. right. All right. Where are all his wonders that our fathers told us about when they said, did not the Lord bring us out of Egypt? Where are those wonders at? Mm -hmm. Where are those wonders when um, uh, Patty's mother was in the hospital, mm -hmm. I went up to visit her. I went by myself, mm -hmm. and uh, Patty now was there. And I know Mother Chewy likes praise. Yeah. So me with my voice, uh -huh. I get down by her, and I start singing. Right. I don't know. I, it may have been hallelujah, something very soothing, mm -hmm. like, and I start singing, and machines and start stuff start going, cause she was she was it was doing something to her, mm -hmm. and I, I I couldn't read, I could I, I didn't know yeah. what was going, but I know she was being like revived, yeah. and they were, they 
they was, the nurses were seeing it. And the nurse was calling out oh, something over the thing. I'm like, well, you know, maybe I should, maybe I should go. <laughs> Uh, Man, okay. oh. God is good. Yes, he yes, is. is. Where is that God? He's still here. Yes. Yes. He's still here. He's still, yes. he's still working wonders. He's still the mighty God. Yes. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. We're just not applying Come on. Yes. what we are. We're so full. Yeah. We're so full of what the Holy Spirit. <clears throat> has a silence, yeah, yes, but we're not using it, mm -hmm. and we got it. We got to use it. Uh -huh. Um, Keila mm -hmm. called her on the phone. She in the hospital in Del Dorm. Mm -hmm. This was, you know, she had started doing my nails, and then she got sick, and she went in the hospital. And uh, we both praying in tongues, hard. Mm -hmm. Oh, I mean, she praying, I'm praying. I mean, we had some good. Mm -hmm. Praise going on. Yes, yes. Hallelujah. I know it brought joy to her. Mm -hmm. I know it brought some strength to her. Amen. And I mean, this woman was going down in tongues. I don't know if she never spoke in tongues or she has spoken. I don't know nothing about all yeah. that. But I know when I started speaking on tongues mm -hmm. and tongues, on the other end was speaking on tongues. Amen. We didn't have to say anything about cancer. Yeah. We didn't have to say anything about anything else. We just went into the Holy Spirit. Yeah. 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 Right into it, Lord. Woo. Lord, still the same God. You no, know, uh, went to visit my mom, which is in uh, Fort Worth, and my cousin had came over, Carolyn. She had came over, and uh, she had got out. Now she had done been sick and all this other stuff, but. The Lord had told me she was going to be driving again, and she was driving again. Amen. And so uh, she came over, and I was walking her back to her vehicle, and uh, we're standing out there in the street, mm. in her vehicle, and speaking in tongues. Mm. Just speaking in tongues. Mm. Nothing else. Not saying nothing about this, nothing about that. Amen. Just, I mean, these are the memories I have yeah. of, yeah. of the saints with the saints yeah. speaking in the spirit. That was our conversation. Oh, yeah. That was our conversation. Oh, yeah. I'm speaking and she's. We're responding yes. to one another in a whole nother language. Yes. Out in the open. Yes. In the street. Yeah. My God. Mm -hmm. Woo. Awesome. Do it. Hallelujah. Oh God, you show me. You can't me. tell me. You cannot tell me yeah. what yeah. God cannot do. That's yeah. right. You cannot Ooh, tell me yes, because if he says that black chair is white, yeah. that black chair gonna turn white. Yeah. 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 What he speaks yeah. is yeah. Yeah. absolutely. Yeah. So he cannot lie. Yes. Amen. Ooh. He said, "I can't deny myself." No. That's what he said. I can't deny myself. <laughs> I can deny myself. Yes. Can, and you can deny yourself. Yes. He said, I can't deny myself. Uh -uh. I am. I am. From generations to generations, call to me, I am. I will be whatever it is you need. That means there's so many names for him. The Bible has given us some. We have a list of some. Yeah. But whatever you need him to be, I am. Yes, I am the living one. Yes. Because you're thirsty. Yes. I am the bread. Yes. Because you're hungry. Yes. <laughs> you told the woman at the well, drink of me, you never go thirsty again, girl. Yes. She said, well, give me some of that living one. Yes. So I don't have to keep coming back to this place. Amen. So I don't have to keep coming back to this place. Amen. I don't have to keep coming back to this situation. Amen. Give me that living water. Yeah. Release me. Uh -huh. Amen. Set me free. Set me free. Yeah. Set me free. Yeah. So I have to keep coming back. Yeah. In the noon time. Yeah. In different times, cause people are talking about me. Yeah. You know what? Woo, come on now. Let me talk to the saints. Come on now. <laughs> Ooh, this about not wanting people to know your business. Uh, come on. 
I'm not going to tell anybody that I got mm -hmm. uh, whatever it is, yeah. arthritis, yeah. because they be talking mm -hmm. about me. Child, please. Do you think you matter to them that much? Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Because once they brought you up, that was done with. Yeah. It's a whole nother paragraph yeah. of people we can talk about now. Yeah. Absolutely. Nobody is stopping at your paragraph to lift up your situation because you that important. Yeah. Amen. The people getting mad. And, and and walking in unforgiveness yes. because of this or that. Come That's on. crazy Let's stuff. Yes. Amen. Amen. That's crazy. Absolutely. Yeah. Who else cares? Yeah. Who cares? Amen. That is you hung up on a little you bitty know. thing. Yeah. A little yeah. demon, a bishop say, got you hung up yeah. because you don't want to forgive somebody because they looked at you or they talked about you or they said my name in their message. Come on. <laughs> you got to get over that yeah. because yeah. you're hindering yourself. Yeah. You're becoming bitter. Come yeah. on. Yeah. That's right. That's right. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. Another thing with the saints, mm -hmm. I'm just going to say it. Come on. Let's yeah. say it real. When people began to take sides against God Ooh. and his word, yeah. 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 Come on. because of of our friendship mm -hmm. with sister girl, yeah. a brother, brother. Mm -hmm. All right, we might be friends, mm -hmm. but if you are going in a wrong direction and God can't turn you around, there's nothing I can do to turn you around. But you ain't taking me from my secure place. I'm in a secure place. He keeps me. He watches over me. He provides for me. He takes care of the enemies. I'm going to be well, all right. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. The saints of God are walking in pettiness. Yes. And they got to stop it. They've got to stop it. We don't want any hurt, harm, or danger to come to any of God's children. Amen. We want them all to be safe. But this little stuff that that, that is, is real low. Yeah. Real low, God will deal with that. Yeah, yes, yeah. Will. your situation, that little bitty stuff, uh -huh. you hold your head up. That's what the dignity. Yeah. You hold your head yeah. up. That's the strength. Yeah. You hold your head yeah. up and you go for it. Yeah. With what God has asked for you. Yeah. Amen. Absolutely. Come on. Moses missed going into the promised land Come on. because of people in his church. Yeah. 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 to the rock yeah. and water come out. Yeah. And Moses was so fed up with hearing the stuff and all that, yeah. he took his staff and he struck it. Yep. Wrong. Yeah, I told you. Yeah. Ain't what he told you to do. That's right. Because the rock represents God. God. Yeah. 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 Mm. yeah. You, you lay the blow on me? Yeah. Now my enemies lay blows on me. Yeah. They pulled out my beard. Come on. They spit come in my face. Yeah. But my own people, people. Yeah. you gonna strike me? Yeah. Yeah. You gonna strike me? Yeah. You're not going in. Yeah. Yeah. You'll see it from Ooh. afar. Yeah. You'll see it from afar. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. You're not going in. Oh, and all the grumbles. Mm -hmm. You ain't you ain't going either. Yeah. Yeah. You didn't. You ain't going nowhere. No. Right. You're gonna march around this place. Let's get started and let's line up. Yes. Uh -huh. 40 years yes. for every day yes. that you grumbled against yes. me. Yes. 40 years for every day. Yes. 40 days mm -hmm. in the wilderness. Yes. It cost them. Yes, it did. It cost them. Uh-huh. It cost them. Isn't it? Yes. Isn't it? Yes. yes. It's not worth it. No, it's not worth it. But if you have a relationship with God, make it real. Yes. 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 Through the hard times. Yes. Yes. Through the, the suffering. Yes. When somebody has said something about you. Yeah. When when somebody is backstabbed you. Yeah. Or whatever it is, make make your confession real. Yeah. That I am a child of God. Yeah. He suffered. Yeah. But he did not retaliate. Yeah. We got people that retaliate. Yeah. People think they retaliating against you. Yeah. And as they tell Samuel, God told Samuel, they will not rejoice.
rejecting you, they're rejecting me. You can't come against us. Amen. Are you? Yes. If you're doing what is right. That's right. That's right. Yes. That's right. You know, that Joe, Joe got with the Lord. Well, we need to discuss some things. Because some things are happening in my life. Come on. And Lord, I, I need to, you know, yeah, we need to talk. talk. Come on. Yeah. But at the end of the conversation, mm -hmm. on. Joe said, I put my hand yeah. on my yeah. 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 You too yeah. need for me. Yeah. 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 I wasn't around yeah. for that. I don't know how that, and I don't know where that, yeah. I don't yeah. know yeah. anything. Yeah. 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 I can't answer you, Lord. Amen. The yeah. Lord had told you, gird yeah. up yourself yeah. like a man. Yeah. Yeah. You know, we're going to handle this thing. Gird yeah. yourself up. We're going to have this word thing going yeah. on. Yeah. Yeah. Where were you? So be careful uh, of going against God's yeah. house, yeah. even if it's not a perfect house. Mm -hmm. yeah. Because a lot of people are doing some crazy, evil things today. Yes. But when you're coming against God's house, mm -hmm. it's not the people. A battle is not with flesh and blood. Hallelujah. You find yourself, you're coming against God. That's right. Mm. Your, your eyes are still in the natural. Mm -hmm. But you're a spiritual being. you got to see in the spirit. Amen. 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 Oh God. You gotta see in the spirit. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Mm. Hallelujah. Yes. Ain't it good? Yes, yes. Yes. All right, I'm gonna get ready to close. Yes. Hallelujah. Woo, Jesus. Amen, God. Word. Amen. Look at seven. Uh eleven. Nope. Let's go there. What was that again? What did you say? Hmm? Oh, uh, I, th I heard a whisper. I did. Yeah, mother, mother, mother did. We, okay, uh, let's let's look at, at nine. Okay. <clears throat> right before it. This is what the Lord, the God of Israel says. I, I brought you out of Egypt, out of the hand of slavery. I snatched you from the power of Egypt and uh, from the hand of all your oppressors. I drove them from before you and gave their land. I said to you, I am the Lord your God. Do not worship the gods of the Amorites in whose land you live, but you have not listened to me. Mm -hmm. And then the angel of the Lord came and sat down under the tree where his son Gideon was threshing. I did read that. And he said, he called him a mighty warrior. Verse 13. But Sarah, Gideon replied, if the Lord is with us, why is all this happening? Let's go to verse 14. And the Lord turned to him and said, go in the strength you have and save Israel out of Midian's hand. Am I not sending you? But Lord, Gideon asked, how can I save Israel? My clan is the weakest. We the, we the, we the weakest and the poorest. Yeah. <laughs> How can I go do it? We ain't got a penny in the bank. Right. We, we can't do this. We can't do that. And he said, I'm the least in my family. But you know, I look at it. Even though we are a small ministry, yeah. God has not left us Amen. without I mean, yeah. Thank you, Lord. It's not the size. It is not the size. Amen. And the Lord answered, I will be with you, and you will strike yes. down all the Midianites together. And Gideon replied, If I if now I have found favor in your eyes, give me a sign that it is really you talking to me. Because okay. uh, you know he ain't really they ain't heard. Right. You know, I need to know. Mm -hmm. And a lot of times if we in doubt, we say, Lord, well, you know, give me a sign. I want to be sure yes. I'm, I'm trusting you. And that, there's, there's a little something I just don't want to. I don't want to do the wrong thing in this night. Right. You know what I'm saying? But please do not go away until I come back and bring my offering and set it before mm. you. And the Lord said, I will wait until you return. Now, all before this, we, we didn't see anything about the Israelites doing offerings. No. Nobody, you know, no, doing, no, doing no. any of that. But the Lord was talking to that prophet because he sent that prophet mm -hmm. to give him a word. Amen. And the Lord said, I will wait until you return. And Gideon went in, prepared a young goat, and from uh, Ephah of flour, he made bread without yeast, knew to do that. Mm -hmm. uh, put in the meat in a basket and his broth in the pot. He brought them out and offered them to him under the oak. So sometimes people can be so wrapped up in their problems, mm -hmm. they forget about their praise. Yes. Yes. They forget about their worship. Yes. 
Yeah. It's just always prayer. I need, I need, I need, yeah. I need. Can you? Can you? Yes. Help yes. me, help me. Yes. But it's it's not the the uh, uh, the the, pr uh, the praise uh, uh, or the worship unto him. Mm -hmm. And then the angel of God said to him, take the meat. Now the Lord has instructed him mm -hmm. how to do it right. Yeah. Uh, you know, you're giving me a partial, uh -huh. but I want you to do the fullness yeah. of this. You're giving me a partial. Yeah. So the angel of God says to him, take the meat and the unleavened bread, place them on this rock. Mm -hmm. The rock, you see that rock in there? Mm -hmm. It's a symbol of Christ. Yes. You know? Amen. And pour out the broth. Uh -huh. Now you go to Leviticus and you look at the uh, uh, sacrifices and stuff like that, burn offerings and, mm -hmm. and uh, um, drink offerings and all yes. of that. You can boil the meat, but you mm -hmm. pour out the broth, mm -hmm. you know, and you don't, you know, mm -hmm. the do's and don'ts. Mm -hmm. And Gideon did so. And with the tip of the staff that was in his hand, the angel of the Lord touched the meat and the unleavened bread. And fire flared from the rock, consuming the meat and the bread. Mm. And the angel of the Lord disappeared. Mm. Then when Gideon realized that, right. that it was the angel of the Lord, he exclaimed, All sovereign Lord, Woo. I have seen the angel of the Lord face to face. Yes. Yes. Amen. Amen. Lord, Amen. Lord. Amen. When you begin to see the oh, softness yes, of Lord. people's hearts, yes. okay, God, you're moving. Mm -hmm. I got you can tell when God is moving. Yes. As the song said, there's a sound that comes. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. There's more than just sound. Yes. Mm -hmm. a fiery thing. Thank you, Lord. Because our God can come in any kind of way. Yes. You, you need to know. Yeah. You need to know. Yeah. There are sounds, there are looks, there are smells. Yes. 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 God can use a cartoon. Yes. Yes, he can. <laughs> He can use a baby, he can yeah. use a child, yeah. he can use a garden, yeah. he can use a bird that's singing and just yeah. won't shut up. Yeah. He can use all kinds, he can use a bird in bush. Yeah. Yes. 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 Amen. Come on. <laughs> Don't limit God. Yeah. You're only on Sunday. That's right. Because you're missing a lot in between. Oh, There's a lot of yeah. stuff happening. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Monday through Saturday. Yeah. And you, you you know, you just want to come on Sunday and pick that word up. But there's more. more yeah. You're missing a lot of meat. You're missing a lot of, of giving of the, your sacrifices of praise unto him. You're missing a lot. Amen. Glory. And this is another thing, and I'm going I'm to close with this, and this is with people that's watching it, that um, maybe you do have a, a special reason why you cannot go go to church. Mm -hmm. Come on. Maybe there's a special reason why, and, and I'm sure you know God understands that. Amen. But those that are at home and Amen. you uh, got your feet propped up, yeah. and then you stop it so you can go to the microwave, and you stop it. Mm -hmm. I mean, you go back and play, and then you stop it again so you can get your drink, and then here. you stop it. And then you catch it some of it later, mm -hmm. and you stop it. Come on. Come on. Come on. You're not really get into the, yeah, coming into the prayer. You, you, you're not uh, observing him with a rightful attitude. Amen. Amen. He's at my fingertips mm -hmm. when I say so. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. I mean, that's just me. Mm -hmm. This is just my thought. Mm -hmm. That when you put it on, yeah. it should be this time of oh, reverence. Yeah. I think yeah. we're missing that. I think you're missing the reverence yes. of God. Uh -huh. You know, not to say, you know, okay, you got to go and do this, you got to mm -hmm. do that. But I'm just saying the reverencing mm -hmm. of God, mm -hmm. giving the honor mm -hmm. that is due Him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Maybe getting into prayer before you... Start it. Uh -huh. Maybe getting into some prayer after you heard the message. Amen. Giving him a little reference. Amen. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. uh, lifting up his name. Mm -hmm. And then, yeah. uh, you know, become. Mm -hmm. I think we're getting away from so much that we're beginning to miss out and not getting the fullness. Because there is things that God wants to do with each one of us. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Amen. I'm going to close Amen. there. God is good. He's an awesome yes, God. Yes, hallelujah. Yes. Amen. 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 Amen.
The love of Christ. Amen. 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 It's good. It's good. Jerry, you want to close us out in prayer? Amen. Amen. God, God is good. good. <laughs> Come on down the aisle. Come on down the aisle. Shut up in your bones. Wake that fire up. Bring it up. Bring it up. <laughs> oh, right. Um, okay. Amen. Amen. Wow, thank you, Lord, for, yes. this, uh, for these two days. Thank you for yes. the prayer that, that went forth yes. last night, Father God, the yes. petitions that were lifted up, Lord. Yes. I thank you for the word that went forth. I, I pray that you will pour back into our speakers. Yes. Anoint Hallelujah. them, anoint them uh, and, and uh, bless their household, whatever they're personally yes. seeking yes. for you, Father. Yes. They pour so much, so much knowledge and so much yes. wisdom today, Father yes. God. I, I pray that today that they would just be blessed. They would be honored yes. in their households yes. and who they interact with for the rest of the day. And Lord, we are praying a uh, uh, spirit of celebration be in this place yes. today. Yes. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. We are dismissed. Amen. Amen.